What is up guys, Tori Drake, Dendro Realtor, and welcome to another new construction home tour. If you're new to my channel, welcome. I do a ton of new construction home tours, and something that's really important to understand is because I got a playlist of, ton, uh, of a lot of the home tours I've done, is that it doesn't matter when I post that video, a day ago, five years ago, you can still watch that video and shop for that home. And the reason that is, is because they're model homes, just because that exact home I'm in, in the video properly sold, that the, the builder is taking that same model home and building it in different communities. So feel free to knock yourself out and don't worry about the date of when that was posted. Just watch the video, see if you like the home, and then feel free to reach out to me and uh, ask where else they are building that model or models like it. I'd love for you to leverage the relationships I have from doing as much work as I've done in new construction. All right, guys, we are in the Crystal Valley community today. If you want to know more about that community, watch my Crystal Valley community tour. I, I'll show you lots of footage of what it looks like to live here, talk about the amenities, all that good stuff. Behind me, as I mentioned, is Silverthorne from Century Communities, a beautiful home. Let's go ahead and jump into the tour. So that sales office there that you see attached to the home is where the garage would normally be, just so you know. Right when you come in, you got a guest bathroom right there for your convenience and the home office. Which, let's, let's, let's be honest, who doesn't love a bathroom right when you come in the door? I won't lie, the door is a little bit of an odd placement. I love the siding on the wall, it's really pretty and unique. And the storage is a little interesting on that one. But hey, more storage is more storage. Before we go upstairs, let's check out the living room. I like the long rectangular living space here as opposed to as opposed to cramming it together. I like they stretch it out. It's not as wide because of that. However, I like the length of it. Check out the pantry and this locked door that probably goes to the sales office. Next up, we're gonna check out the back patio, backyard situation. It's a modest back patio, but enough to get the job done of being able to sip your morning coffee or you know have a, a glass of wine at the end of the day, enjoy sunrise, sunset. Because trust me, in Castle Rock, you get beautiful sunrises and beautiful sunsets being right up in the mountains like that. It's awesome. There is a basement on this one. However, there's a sign on the door right there. I don't know if you can see it. That says, you know, please do not enter. The construction workers are using it as an office downstairs. So we will respect that and go upstairs. I do like it when the uh, home office is separated from the bedrooms, so that way you don't have to worry about making noise. If you're working and someone's sleeping, you don't have to worry about hearing noise, making noise, any of that stuff by having it so removed. Check out this guest bedroom number one. That same green paneling that was in the bathroom is on this bedroom right here, and I'm a big fan of it. I am here for it, I dig it. Check out, oh, actually no, we're gonna save that primary bedroom for last, excuse me. Grand finale, you know? I just like that sign about the bed, honestly. I would just want them to include that. Guest bathroom. And then you have extra desk space out here in the hallway. 
you want the kids doing homework out there, anything like that. Which kid gets the walk-in closet? That's, that's a big one. And you always gotta appreciate the washer and dryer being on the same room, or sorry, level as the primary bedroom. Epic Homes, which is one of my favorite builders, a lot of times they put the wash and dryer in the closet of the primary bedroom. And, oh, that's so cool. Now I know it's just decor design, but I really, really, really like the mirrors on the side of the bed here. It adds some space to the room, it adds some dimension to it. I really dig it, I haven't seen that before. His and her sinks. Or hey, you know, hers and hers, him and him's, his and hers. nice long walk-in closet. It's always nice to be able to walk like deep into a closet. It feels extra luxurious that way. Well, that is the Silver Thorn from Century Communities, guys. Thank you so much for watching the video. Once again, feel free to watch as many of the model home tours as you'd like, and don't worry about when it was posted, because again, just because that exact one of the video may not be for sale, they're still building that model in that same community, or if that community is done in other communities like it. I'd love for you once again to leverage my resources if you are hoping to buy, purchase a new construction home, and I also do work outside of the new construction space. So basically, no matter what you need in the greater Denver area, reach out to me using my contact information in the description. It's so fun to hear from you guys. I've heard from quite a few of you already. I've uh, helped quite a few of you close deals already. It's so fun, so cool. And I would love to help you. Yes, you watching this. Hit that like button. Hit that subscribe button. Help your boy out. And I'll see you on the next one.